All right, guys. Turkey stuffed. You're stuffed. You don't want to look at any more cooking, but you know you need to make some kind of dessert. And I know that on Thanksgiving, traditionally people make pumpkin pie, but that takes quite a bit of effort. And who has time for that? So if that's what's bothering you, Bunky, I've got a solution that's perfect because it's kind of a combination of pie and cake. In fact, you start with the cake, or, well, most of the cake. What can I tell you? Chef's prerogative. The beauty of it is you don't even need a whole cake. It could be a bunt cake like this. It can be a round cake. It can be a, a flat cake, pancake, whatever you want. What you need is you need cake, you need whipped cream, and you need some cherry pie filling, which is what you've got right here. What we're gonna do now is we're going to take this cake and we're going to start off by just crumbling some of it up put it in the bottom of the pan and i'm using a glass pipe paper it doesn't have to be the only reason i use the glass is because guess what it looks cool all right then i'm going to put a little bit of cream on it you know and you don't want to bury it alive but you want to have enough in there to make it interesting because what this actually is is it's a type of parfait that was coined by the British, they call it a trifle. And then you want to spread some of your pie filling in there again, you know, enough to give it some interesting color, but you don't want to kill it, because then we're going to make another layer. And again, just crumble it up. Neatness does not count here, guys. And then another layer of cream. And when you spoon this out, like I said, it's like basically, it's your basic parfait. And then put on some more of the cherries. And sometimes I'll even top this with a little bit of caramel drizzle or chocolate drizzle, just to make it interesting. Okay, a little more cake. Sometimes I even just put a little cake crumbs on the top just to make it look festive and then like I said all you got to do is dish it out nothing to it scoop serve and eat it doesn't get any easier than this not even on man cave munchies and the nice thing about it is my guests aren't even going to arrive until later on so you can make this a day or so in advance because as long as you make sure that none of the cake is like sitting right on top where it can get stale, the whipped cream and all the sauce and everything is going to take care of business. Mm. Speaking of which, there you have it guys, chocolate cherry trifle. An easy to make dessert from man cave munchies.